Welcome to Bermuda Sports Network. A live coverage of the USL Premier Development League featuring the Bermuda Hogs, the first of eight matches uh, that will be staged in Bermuda. Six will be played overseas. Today they take on the top of the table, Reading United here at BAA Field. I'd like to congratulate, congratulate Maurice Lowe. He's, uh, he has replaced uh, Scott Morton as the head man for uh, the first time. And he's uh, really selected some interesting players for the Hogs. And to give you the lineup in gold, it's going to be Timmy Figueredo starting. He's wearing the blue top and uh, black shorts. The Hogs in uh, gray, green and uh, white, while the Reading United is in blue and white. Main of the team, Daniel Andrade, Rakeem DeShields, Roger Lee, Jalen Bather. Midfield, Angelo Simmons, Troy Tucker, Kwame Steed, Keyshan Bean, D'Amico Coddington, and the lone man up front, Antoine Russell. On the bench, Taj Bell, Chris Casey, Travis Wilkinson, Corvon Tucker, LaShawn Dill, Casey Castle, and LaShawn Simmons. Reading United's starting 11 for tonight includes Brian Holt, Brian Forgey, Anton Seeley. So you have a corner kick already in the match. So the first corner for Reading. Uh, the remainder of the team, Matt Hedges, Stephen Okai, Chris Harmon, Christian Barrio, Brian Spann, Leslie Savradi, Brian Ownby, and Will Bates. On the bench, Brett Molin, Chris Wheeler, Josh Rice, Sean Peckham, and Tyler Whitmer. That's just getting underway here. Bermuda really having to double up this weekend. We have another match coming up on uh, Sunday against New Jersey. But right now, the main focus is on Reading United. United, we should mention, as the game progresses here, they've already played four matches, so they're pretty much tuned up in this Premier Development League. Just want to make quick mention here of the officials. Out there, we have the referee from Sarasota, Florida, Ted Uncle. The referee's assistants being Coon Evans and Anton Augustus, and the fourth official, Anthony Machette. Once again, the man in the middle from Florida, Ted Uncle. Free kick two from Yuda. Lee going to the right, headed forward. The Hogs trying to get something going over there. Flicked inside, oh, cut out very nicely there by Stephen Okai. A throw in on the far side for the Hogs. Angelo Simmons tries to turn, but Tucker turns it inside. Oh, there's a shot. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. One nil. And the Hogs take the lead. I think it's Keyshan Bean. Keyshan Bean from the edge of the box. So after only four minutes, the Hogs have taken the lead through Keyshan Bean. Quick start for the Hogs here. We haven't even had time to mention that the Reading United outfit is uh, unbeaten in four outings. They defeated Brooklyn 3-1, Westchester 4-1, New Jersey 4-0, and Ocean City 4-1. Hawks have got off to a good start here. Figueredo. 
Big boot going left, looking for Coddington. Unable to control it. Bermuda Hogs won, Reading United nil. Throw in for the visitors. It's going to be Brian Forgu. He's the right back. It's flicked inside, headed out by Hedges. Oh, Brian Holt, the goalkeeper, has to scamper there. The Hawks come up with it. Turns inside to Bean. Oh, headed out by Hedges. From you to backpedaling. Figueredo at the edge of the ball. Oh, what a costly mistake. Oh, he was a costly mistake by Timmy Figueredo. He should have cleared it one time. And uh, I thought that was a bad piece of goalkeeping indeed. Outside the box, unable to pick it up. And he tried to control it with a striker right there in front of him. So uh, after six minutes, it's all level. 1-1-1. One, one, one. And we'll tell you who that goal scorer is momentarily here. As soon as he turns and uh, we get his number, number 20, that's going to be Will Bates. Costly mistake by Timmy Figueredo. Bean now, chipping forward, Russell, and it's watched very closely there by Hedges. So after a really great start by the Hogs, Timmy Figueredo makes a major blunder. Free kick, Redding. Okai turns it inside, Hedges goes forward, oh, Bean gets a boot on it, Tucker, back to Bean. To Coddington, to Steed, oh, Hedges will watch it go all the way through to Keeper Holt. Brian Holt, he's not a very large keeper. Throwing it out now. Midfield there, Ownby. On Reddings left back, turns it inside to Holt. Sprays it out here to Forgy. Hedges in the middle looking for Lassie. There's the midfielder there, Barrio. Okai sprays it out to his right over here to Span. Cross inside and cut out. And oh, the flag goes up. The flag goes up. It will be a corner kick, the second for the match for Redding. Nine minutes down and level 1 1. From Utah's opening match in the 2011 USL Premier Development League. Bean to Steed, chipping forward, looking for Russell. It's a dummy there by Forgy. Forgy still, Brian Forgy still in possession, turns it inside. Okai goes to his left over there. Okai again. Seems to be a workhorse for the Reading United outfit, spraying it off to his right over here. Ryan Forgy goes back inside to Hedges. Through ball for Lassie. Lassie to his left. Goes all the way back to Seeley. The left back to Okai. Go to the extreme left now. They're moving the ball around very nicely. Bates, Will Bates. The goal scorer. 
All the way back, Mel. Okai chipping to the far right over here to Span on the right wing. He's being watched very closely there by Jalen Bather. Coddington comes up with it inside to Steed. Back to Bather. Throw in Hogs. Jalen Bather just in front of our sports microphones. Finds Coddington. He's quickly shut down. Span chipping forward. Oh. Be watched closely all the way by Rakeem DeShields back to Figueredo. Figueredo again lackadaisical back there. His kick took a deflection. Dean sprays it out to his right. Over there, Angelo Simmons. Working on Seeley. Flag goes up. It's a new look Bermuda Hogs team in comparison to last season. Good to see former Hogs skipper Kwame Steed, dynamic player coach for Devonshire Cougars in the lineup, along with his colleague, Tomiko Coddington, who just sprayed it off to Keyshan Bean, finds Angelo Simmons. He'll have one from out there and just wide. Head goalkeeper Brian Holt diving to his left. You're watching all the action on Bermuda Sports Network. Bermuda's only 24-hour sports station. Goal kick for the United. Going in search of their fifth straight win of the season. Headed out there very nicely. They come again. Oh, a shot from the edge of the box by B Christian Barrio, but a little bit off target and slightly left of goal. He really didn't connect properly with it. Goal kick, Hogs. Figueredo prepares to take the goal kick. Down the center, Steed tries to bring it down. Span gets a boot on it. Steed gets a second bite. Oh, this is interesting. This is interesting. 2-1. 2-1. Brian Ownby gives the visitors the lead. In the 14th minute, So in a 10 minute span, the Reading United team has hit back with two goals and now are leading two to one. 14 minutes down, Bermuda scoring in the fourth minute. The clearance, headed down. Oh, this is a chance again. Bather does well, slips around Span. Coddington, Coddington, he's in the box. And the whistle goes at the edge of the box. Hedges pulls him down, and the referee is calling him, wondering if he's going to get a lecture or a yellow card, the first booking of the match. Yes, he's going into his pocket. So Hedges goes in. To the book. Three-man wall. 
Coddington will take the free kick. Some four or five yards outside the box. The wall being told to dress back. Can the Hogs get on level terms here? Be interesting with all along the ground. The shields are outside now to Bather who tries to turn it inside. Lobbed forward. And eventually headed into touch by Lee. A flick inside, Troy Tucker now clearing for the Hogs. All the way down to their right back, Brian Foggy. Oh, this is a chance again for the goal scorer. Oh, from an acute angle this time, Ownby knocks it high and wide to the delight of Figueroa. We're only 16 minutes down and three goals already. in the United Soccer League Premier Development match between Bermuda Hogs and Reading United. Figueredo knocks it off the field. He's not having the best first half here. Throw in quickly taken. Okai hedges back to Okai. Oh, off the chest of Simmons. Bean flicking on for Russell. Russell, oh, well done by goalkeeper Holt. Denying Bermuda the equalizer. Throw in Hogs. Daniel Andrade. Oh, chested back towards Andrade. He had to really work hard to stay in possession there. And a corner for the Hogs. Their first of the match. Coming in the 18th minute. Andre, Daniel Andre will take the corner. As Simmons comes to the sideline, there's a uh, straight to big number 13, Lassie. All the way back now to Roger Lee. Span takes a deflection off of Troy. Tucker throw in, quickly being taken by Bates. Flicked around there by Lassie. Oh, there's appeals at the edge of the box, a free kick to Redding. Referee Ted Uncle from Florida, right on top of the play. This is interesting. Bermuda Hogs cannot afford to go down 3-1 this early in the match. We're in the 19th minute of play. This is directly in the center of the field. Standing over it is Lassie. So Schwerde. And another player to his left. Five man wall. Bather is watching Span. And here it comes. Oh, just over the top by Lassie. Go kick hogs. It's Reading United 2, Bermuda Hogs 1. The Hogs taking the lead in the fourth minute. Reading equalizing in the sixth, and then the go-ahead goal in the 14th. Oh, knocked firmly down the field by Lee.
Okai. Goes to his right over here. To Forgi to span. Inside to Okai. Flick back again to Forgi. Short passing by the visitors. Barrio chipping forward. Oh, the Hawks come up with it. Cullington to Tucker. Tucker. Short ball to Bather. Chipping inside for Russell. Up goes Hedges. Okai is there and Cottington as well. Steed flicking it on. And it falls to number three over there. Harmon and Reading United. Span on the right side. Trying to get around Bather. Lee comes in and the firm tackle. And the whistle goes. Could this be a second booking? Yes, he's being called. Yeah, he's yet to go to the pocket. Yes, he's going to the pocket. So the second booking, Roger Lee. Two yellow cards in the match thus far. Free kick, Redding. Kick taken by Lassie. It's cleared. Off the chest of Russell. Bean with the, he's three on two. Okai tries to strip him. And Okai. Oh, well done. Good defending by Okai. As Russell has just got a serious lesson on how to toughen up as Okai pushed him to the ground. He's a tough tackling, no nonsense defender. Andrade. And another booking, this time Daniel Andrade. So three yellow cards in the first 23 minutes of play. Two men wall. Andrade and Simmons. <clears throat> I believe that's Harmon over there too. No, that's not Harmon. He's at the back post. Here comes the free kick. Oh, just in front of Span and Harmon at the back post. Straight across the goal mouth. No one there to direct it into the back of the net. Goal kick hogs. Reading United 2, Bermuda Hogs 1. Figueredo down the middle, up goes Okai. Steed. Steed to Coddington, unable to control it. Oh. Foggy unable to control it. Now a throw in. Bather down the line for Coddington. Bather. Oh, stripped by Barrio. Bates. Bates uh, inside. The flag is down. Oh, good defending there by Lee. As Ownby had a chance to at least get a cross in or a shot on goal from the right angle. Good piece of defending by Roger Lee. Go kick hogs. 
Steed is pushed underneath. The referee, Ted Uncle, right there to watch everything. That was against Lassie. Roger Lee preparing to take the free kick. Chipping going to the right. Russell. It's a throw in. Daniel Andrade will take the throw. We're in the 27th minute of play. Andrade's oh too much for Bean. Go kick hot. Go kick Reading United. This is the first match for the Bermuda Hogs under new coach Maurice Lowe. Former coach Scott Morton is also on the bench, ably assisted by one of Bermuda's most successful coaches, Gary Darrell. And this is the fifth match for top of the table, Reading United and Bermuda's first outing this season. Cuttington turns it inside. Steed now has overlapping Baylor. He does well to keep it in. Can he get the cross in? Oh yeah. Here's the cross, all oh, straight to Okai. No, he has time. Short ball there to Barrio. Oh, cut out by Tucker. Steed at the edge of the box. Oh, Angelo Simmons. Oh, he hesitated. He who hesitates loses. And he's stripped. And it's a quick counter attack here. Oh, up there, number 15, Own B. Own B inside, and it's over the top. Oh, my. Gosh, Will Bates had an open goal to make it 3-1, and he hit it over the top. What an excellent counterattack there by Reading United. And Bermuda very lucky not to be trailing 3-1. Will Bates must be shaking his head in disbelief. Go kick hogs, Figueredo. Headed forward by Span. Also, Lassie. Flick back there by Ownby. Now Bermuda, Simmons to Bean. Bean has to be careful not to get boxed in. Angelo Simmons, short pass to all. Oh, Okai comes up with it for Redding. Flicks it over to his right over here to Forgy. And Harmon. Okai. Oh, he gives it straight to Simmons, who's unable to control it. Hedges goes to his left to Span. Span over the half line. Still in possession. Goes to his extreme left. Okai now. For Harmon, oh, Bean flicking it up, but oh, a dangerous ball as, as Okai is very, very aggressive on the field. And uh, every tackle that he goes into, he goes into with uh, fierce um, energy. And uh, he really is very, very physical. And the Hogs need to be made aware of that when they go into a tackle with Stephen Okai wearing the yellow boots for Redding. He's like the hatchet man for them. Throw in Redding. Tucker trying to knock it back but goes into touch. A throw in. Steed inside, oh, but straight to goalkeeper Holt. He's to the edge of the box. Kicking down the center. Andrade and Span are there. 
Oh, cleared by Lee. Angelo Simmons tries to control. He has time and space. Long ball, looking for Kwame, who gave up on that one. Is one bounce and into the hands of goalkeeper Holt. He rolls it out. Oh, yes. He gives it up to Harmon there. Coddington now. At the edge of the box, the referee, Ted Uncle, says play on. Steed. Who has the shields right behind him. He goes to his right to Andrade. To the right touch line. And Simmons starts his run. Seely is chasing Simmons. And referee's assistant says go kick. We're in the 32nd minute of play. Reading leading two goals to one. On this beautiful May evening. First of two matches this weekend for the Bermuda Hogs. Hedges now. Lassie going all the way back to Forgy. Coddington comes in to close him down, but Hedges comes back to give him an option. Also there is Barrio. Okai. Barrio to Okai. Harmon goes to his left to span. This is interesting. Oh, he tries one. All done by Timmy Figueredo. Trying to redeem himself from an earlier blunder. To the edge of the box. Looking for Simmons. Seely is also down there. Oh, foul. Seely preventing Simmons from uh, going forward. And normally when Uncle calls you like that, he's going to have some serious words and it's a good chance you could go in the book. But in this instance, it's just the words from the man in the middle. So Seely is lucky not to become the fourth person to be booked in this match. B now with the free kick towards the back post all oh, too long a little bit too ambitious from Keyshan Bean we're in the 34th minute of play goal kick to Reading United Slow getting his first major appointment as a head coach. Outstanding player in his own right with the Dandy Town Hornets. Bean all oh, gives it up to Okai. Hedges. Short ball to Forgy. Down the line. Chasing there is own B, but well done. Very nicely done by Roger Lee. Good piece of defending. Throw in to the visitors. And all of the action is right here on Bermuda Sports Network. Own B flicking over his head. Harmon with the cross towards the back wall, too far for Span. He's chasing and will, uh, unable to keep it in play. Throw in Hogs. Andre short to Steed. The Shields. Oh, he's going to give it straight to Harmon there. D'Amico Coddington goes into a rough tackle. Lays it off of Keyshan. It's a good chance for the Hogs here. Simmons to his right. Oh, he lays it off behind him and disrupts the tempo of the play. B now, wa being watched closely by Hedges. Oh, Hedges gets the boot on it, throw in Hogs. Oh, 
10 minutes remaining in this, the first half of Bermuda's first match of the season. Al Simmons, oh, steals a chance. Oh, look at this. Kwame Steed, indecisive there. I didn't know if he was crossing or trying to shoot. I believe he was trying to chip it across the goal mouth, but indecisive. He could have even had a shot from there. Brian Holt, the goalkeeper for Reading now, preparing to take the goal kick. <clears throat> it's Reading 2, Hogs 1. Firm header there by Bather. Coddington settles under. Coddington trying to find someone to deliver it to. Finds Troy Tucker who has to back battle. To Shields has Andre to his right. Simmons, but he elects to go down the center. Oh, Russell unable to control it. Okai comes up with it. Span goes to his left over there looking for Lassie. Span again. Turns it inside looking for the big man in Bates. Will Bates it's still Bates to his right to Ownby. Oh, good. Again, Lee with a good sliding tackle, but he'll give up the third corner of the half. And that will be Lassie to take the corner. And this... 38th minute play. So another corner, but this time the opposite side. This time it'll be Barrio, Christian Barrio, to take the corner. the corner punched out by Timmy Figueredo goes back to Barrio <clears throat> Andre going long looking for Russell but Seeley is there to intercept Hedges going long but oh bather Unable to control it. Jalen Bather throwing quickly, taken again. Lassie. Now Kwame Steed to Bean. Switches up play to the right side to Angelo Simmons. Unmarked. He has space. Seeley comes in to close him down. There's the chip towards the back post. Cunnington is, oh, he does well to keep it in play. There's the attendant. Oh, is that a handball? Yes. Handball on the spot. Well watched by referee Ted Uncle. Clearly was a handball. Clearly was a handball in the 40th minute of play. Oh, and he's quite upset with that one. We'll tell you who it is exactly in a minute. Number four, that will be Forgy, the right back. And from here, it was clearly a handball. So it looks like Angelo Simmons is there. He has a chance to pull one back for the Hogs and uh, make it 2-2. Let's see what he does here. Oh, yes. It's all level, 2-2. Left of the keeper. So we're all level 2-2. After 40 minutes of play, Bermuda taking the lead. Reading equalizing and the go-ahead goal. And now Bermuda back on level terms. So in 40 minutes of play, four goals in this USL Premier Development League match at BAA Field. Reading kicking off now. Okay. Oh, quickly onto it was Bean, but Hedges clears, going long. The Shields heading forward. Tucker flicks it on. Okai's there. 
Again, Okai this time knocking it into a small group of spectators down there. Throw in Hogs. Damon Ming and Darius Cox not in the lineup tonight. They're in the Bermuda Hog squad, but they are not dressed up or suited up tonight. As you can see LaShawn Dill warming up over there. LaShawn Simmons, Corvon Tucker, Travis Wilkinson, Chris Casey. So Maurice Lowe has tons of options. Bather with the throw. Russell now. Oh. Good ball over there. Simmons is chasing it down. Seeley is coming like a freight train. Simmons to the edge of the box. Oh, it's still Simmons. Oh, it just doesn't fall for Tucker there. Ownby. And the whistle goes. Free kick hogs. Coddington and Russell are there. Two man wall. Looks as if it's, it's going to be Russell. Oh, wasted effort. They get another chance. Still, Russell. Unbi is chasing. And his man handled off the ball. Gonna be coming out. Oh, some words there. It's some words there, and he's going to is uh is this who number four? That's that's gonna be Forgy. He had some words, and Ted Uncle, the referee, he's a no nonsense referee. So the fourth booking of the match. Two from each team, Hedges, Lee, Andrade, and Forgy, all in the book during the first half of this match. Go keep a halt going long. Steed gets ahead on it. Coddington is watching it. Good tackle by Forgy there. Barrio gets it off. Bather is now being watched closely there by Bates, who throws it in quickly. Harmon turns it inside and gives it straight to Forgy, who has Bates on the right side. Steed cuts it out. Okai going all the way back to Forgy. There's a long ball in the center. Oh, two or three bounces and straight to the goalkeeper, Timmy Figueredo. We're in the 45th minute of play and it's level 2-2. The opening match for the Bermuda Hogs. They'll play eight matches at home and eight overseas this season. And uh, the way that the Reading United team is unbeaten in this their fifth match of the season it's a relatively good start for the local side. Russell trying to flick heel to Simmons. Simmons, Bean. Oh, Seely, Hedges now. Oh, look at this. Hedges is really angry there at Russell and uh, attempts to retaliate. Oh, this is a red card. A red card. So a red card there, and Bermuda reduced to 10 men in the 45th minute as Antoine Russell, a foul from behind on Hedges, is heading to the dressing room.
So the hogs have been reduced to 10 men. And we anticipate hearing the halftime whistle in a moment. And now the hogs are going to have to really pull out all the stops. They're down one man. The fifth booking of the half. Four yellows, one red. to injury time in the first half. Level 2-2, two, two, but one of the important factors is just about a minute or two or so ago, Bermuda's lone striker in the match, Antoine Russell, sent off after a foul from behind on Matt Hedges. Hogs uh, have to settle down now, work as a unit, play more of a possession ball, or they'll be chasing for the better portion of the second half. And there's the halftime whistle, so both teams will heading to the dressing room, and it's all leveled 2-2. Two, two. 